Nothing brings the worst out of us like a good weight. <laughs> Pastor said, you can say that again. It does. I mean, if you want to find out what's really in you, <laughs> just get into something with God and have him make you wait about six months for an answer or to where you feel like he's a million miles away and you're never going to hear from God again. By the way, let me just throw this out. The longer you walk with God, the less feelings you're likely to have. You didn't, some of you didn't get it, did you? In other words, the longer you walk with God, the more he expects you to walk by faith. And not by signs and wonders and confirmations and <laughs> miracles. <laughs> you know, if God tells you to put $1,000 in the offering tomorrow, you don't need three confirmations. <laughs> I'll give them to you. Do it, do it, do it. I remember back when I was, I mean, I was just brand new at all this. So 40 years ago, I felt like God wanted me to give some girl $10. And I was like, now God, if you really want me, if, I, I mean, God, if, you, if it's really you, if you really want me to do this, God. Because see, I was really hoping it really wasn't him because I really wanted to keep my 10 bucks. And I was just learning how to hear from God, and I heard him speak in my heart and say, you know, Joyce, even if I'm not really telling you, I won't get mad at you if you bless somebody. <laughs> so see, you don't need a confirmation to do something good for somebody. You don't need a confirmation to be nice to somebody. 